So it's your nephew's bar mitzvah and Uncle Morty's speech has dragged on so long your partner is going flat. Then you hear the magic word, l'chaim. When Jews raise their glass, why do they almost always proclaim that iconic Hebrew phrase? You keep using the word. I don't think it means what you think it means. Everybody knows that l'chaim means to life. But actually, that's not quite right. It means to lives. Yep, chaim is plural. And that difference makes all the difference. Why this plurality? Well, there are a number of opinions. We all know that a night of alcohol can bring unrestrained pleasure, followed by a distressing morning. But a good drink can bond friends, bring joy, and make gender reveal parties far more tolerable. L'chaim is in the plural to remind us that you can drink to live and use alcohol to elevate, or you can live to drink. And we all know where that can lead to. You probably heard the phrase, in vino veritas, but the Talmud has something to say about that as well. When the wine goes in, the secrets come out. All right, all right, I'll put it in the vault. No good. Too many people know the combination. What combination? We all live two lives. The external is the side we want others to see, and it's often influenced by family, the media, and some regrettable choices. Then there's the inner life. Vibrant, infinitely deep, uniquely beautiful. And God help us if anyone actually sees it. But when we drink, our secret inner life can come out. Quite exuberantly sometimes. And a sensible drink can help those two lives live in a healthy balance. Eat, drink, and be merry for tomorrow we die would not work for a toast at a wedding. But you know, in Judaism, death isn't the end. Just to be clear, the afterlife isn't about lounging on clouds or playing harps. It's the culmination of this life's work, where you experience the person you chose to be. So hopefully that's pleasurable. Think of it like a really well-earned day off. This life and the next are connected by the best thing to celebrate, your hard-earned accomplishments. L'chaim to making the most of life. <laughs>